<gasps> Welcome back. Oh, Murderous Rider. That's a solid gentleman for this Ravnica of Eldraine booster draft. It's only a dollar, so it's not really like a money pick. But if we're taking either Baked into a Pie or Murderous Rider, it's definitely Murderous Rider. And if any of these four come back, they won't. It'll be pretty sweet. So I'm going to take this guy. Have you done any Master Edition flashbacks? No, because I think that set is actual terrible to draft. Master Edition is just such a terrible, terrible draft format. We're not talking about modern Masters. We're talking about just Ma Magic Online Master's Edition. Like, they have Force of Will in it, which is cool. But Force of Will is not worth nearly what it used to be, right? So Master's Edition, Force of Will is like 26 tickets. And then the next most expensive card in the set is Mystic Remora at 3 tickets. But as far as like a draft format goes, that set is like just poop. No offense, draft format. Oh, the magic mirror. Magic mirror on the wall. Who's the rarest of them all? I don't know. I just work here. I actually have no idea. This is terrible, right? It's got to be... I kind of want the glass casket. And then if the black-white knight comes back, then we're in real good shape. Got a bird. Bird is good. We can also take Deathless Knight and try to be black-green. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do this. I think this guy is stronger than the random bird. Or, if we get the Black White Knight, we can just be Mono Black. The aura that requires other auras and there being no other auras in this set. What is that from? Also, Garen Brig Paladin, depending on which way we're going. This is kind of a, a decision tree here. We definitely have this guy for green. We definitely have this guy for white. I don't think that makes you weird. No. We could also take a festive funeral. Oh, man. Did you successfully Overwatch? Uh, if I load it up and play games and exist in those games, then yes, I successfully Overwatched. I think Paladin is just better here. I'm going to take the Paladin. And then we can pass the out muscle, and I feel like we're on okay. We're, we're doing okay here. Did you have fun? Yeah, I did, actually. I had a good time. I think it's definitely... Um, I think there's a definite correlation between the people you play with and the, the amount of fun you have. And... Um, I literally, Chris, I literally tried to add you to the game after after you made that comment. And then you were gone. It's either Transformation Curious Pair or Festive fun fun Funerale. Uh, the group of people I was with was literally Katie, Katie's brother, and Katie's brother's wife. And they're super good people. They're super nice. Um, I'm going to take the transformation. I was definitely not great. Definitely not great. Giant Skewer or Tempting Witch? Uh, sounds like three people. I don't... I guess that's... I guess that's true. That's... Uh, I guess me, me clarifying who they were does not actually cause you to know them so yeah 
Eh, spider's alright. Not super exciting. Wolf's core is okay. Deathless Knight is gas. So is Murderous Rider. Murder is... We got a decent amount of knights here for a black-green deck. I don't think I've... I've never... I don't know I was going to say. I don't think. I've never played Apex. I have no idea what that game even is. There's a lot of red cards that are being passed here. It's like future PUBG. Is that like future Fortnite as well? Thank you. Kyers, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Just want to say thanks for all the great content. Thank you for the great support. Really appreciate you, my dude. Uh, there's not a ton of life game, but you got to remember that it's a food format. So. Is Fortnite dead, or are you just referring to the black hole event that happened today, which was pretty funny? All right, let's hope to open an Oko. All right, Castle Embreath is not in Oko. I am going to take this Savvy Hunter for sure, though. But there is an Outmuscle, there's a Lost Legion, and a Garen Brig Paladin. Maybe one of these will come back. Probably not the Outmuscle. But I think Savvy Hunter is really strong. I kind of want combat tricks, too, because I just want to be able to attack with this, pump it, attack with this, attack with this, attack with this. I just want to keep getting... Getting that sweet, sweet value. A second Grum Gully? I mean, this pack has nothing for us. I guess it's just foreboding fruit. I've got Spurs. That Gargoyle seems pretty rough. We have no artifact synergies, and I just don't care about an O3 that might fly. I'd rather just draw some cards. How you done your random gaming stips? Have you done your random gaming? No, not yet. That's not really a stip though. That's just me taking a break. Also, none of those cards from the first pack came back. The uh, the Resolute Knight. None of the other cards came back. So, um, if we want a trick, this guy's pretty good. I don't think this is a great card, but I think it's fine here. Also, spinning wheel is decent. We have no two drops right now. That's pretty weird. Oh man, I wish I could realistically play this guy. This guy is huge. Opportunistic dragon as well. Jeez. I think we're just taking this. I like having it. Smith and Swordsmith, are you any good in our deck? I don't actually know. Probably. Life gain seems fine, especially with Deathless Knight. Yeah, this guy seems great in our deck. Also, Revenge of the Ravens. Maybe it's Revenge of the Ravens. Like, literally every time they attack. I think this is better for the deck, though. We also have Knight. 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 Knight, Knight. Danny, sounds good, man. Enjoy your painting and your coffee, buddy. Hmm, this one or this one? I'll take this one because it's likely we can see the other guy more frequently. This is a third Grum Gully. Good lord. I'm tempted just to take it because... Maybe we splash for it? It just seems... It's just very strong. Fell the Pheasant. Major Bustin, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. Dubs welcomes. Really appreciate the sub.
Oh, what up, Super Fruits? I think this deck is looking sweet for now. I would like one baked into a pie. That would be nice to have. I am indeed Keeper of the Pepper Jack and Warden of the Meatball. <laughs> Oh, crying out loud. I'm gonna get a meatball sub with pepper jack and mayo and blend it into a sm Nope, don't like that. I'll mail you some of the leftovers. Please make sure that you don't refrigerate in any way so that it's nice and warm when it gets here. That sounds like all I could ever ask for. Pop and Perky, what's going on? Not too bad. I have been enjoying it. I think it's a great set. Crashing drawbridge. God, dipping cookies in sweet onion sauce sounds just terrible, dude. Sammy, what's going on? What's the hold up here? I guess I'll take the gargoyle now. I ain't thrilled about either of these like artifact, these subpar artifact creatures. I'd like this in the deck. Like, Grumbelly is just good with all these other creatures, right? Skeleton Knight, Giant Knight, Wolf's Quarry. Okay. I'll put you with my other Mist. Oh, actually, that's definitely playable. <laughs> I don't even have their. <laughs> oh. Me neither, buddy. Me neither. <sighs> Thank you. Oh my god. Huh? Six months. Love you. Love you too. You are my favorite. You are my favorite. Six months does not seem like nearly enough. Epic Downfall is pretty good. So is this Fierce Witch Stalker. I feed students for free on my spare time when I'm not watching. Really? Is that true? That sounds awesome, dude. Way to go. Good guy Dream Meme Weaver. I believe you can... Oh, it's Katie herself. Look, it's Bognati. I think we're definitely taking this. This seems good in the... 200 burgers in two hours? Oh, shoot, dude. You're the hero we need. Throw some impossible burgers in there and I'm I'm game. Hey 
We have a good time. We have a good time. We had veggie burgers, but they were on the cheap, so yeah. <laughs> oh, I see. You can shell out the big bucks for the beef, but then when it comes to the veggie burgers, I'd still, I'd still take it. I think that's fine. Do I just want second revenge of the ravens? How much is Bone Crusher Giant going for? I think that's like a dollar, right? It is like a dollar. It's also very good. Like if we can splash both of these, it's pretty good. I'm gonna take it just in case. How come we haven't gotten any of the three drops that help you splash things? That's what I'm wondering. It's also Glass Casket, Charm Sleep. I'll just take the Glass Casket number two, I guess. I don't even know, dude. How do you guys need a tropical island? Hey, do you can head, head and order my Facebook page. You can get sweet deals in this card and many more. Wow, Water Sports Drew is basically my uh, marketing guy. Wander Mare? And Double Glass Casket? We have like very like no adventure cards. I'll just take Drown in the Lock, I guess. Yeah, I'll take Marley for under whatever. It's a it's a it's a creature. Wow, it's weird that I'm not getting any of the three drop that helps me splash these two cards that I'm thinking of splashing. That's a laid out muscle that I will gladly take. Literally none. None rose thorn buckos. That's weird to me. Borrow, which just seems good. Uh, oh, we can't get back Murder Shroud. That's super sad. We can get back these guys or this guy, which I guess isn't that exciting. Marley Friar. I mean, it's still the best card in this pack for us, so. Well, that does leave me wanting. This card is not very good, right? I just play Return to Nature in the main deck? I don't even know. How goes... How goes it, you great boner in the sky? Have you been doing any of the Vintage Masters non-Phantom drafts? Seems like... No, and I keep having to answer this because the format just doesn't seem fun to me. Like, I remember playing Vintage Masters and it just was... Not Vintage... No, it's not Vintage Masters. It's just Masters Edition. That's the difference. Vintage Masters is great. Masters Edition, not so much. Uh, yeah, because look, it's uh, Flashback Master's Edition Draft League. It is not Master's Edition. Or Vintage Master's, rather. Okay, I still think these are good enough to splash, even though I have literally no way to fix. God. Is it fine with just, like, two, two, two mountains? I'm gonna do it. I'm just gonna risk it for the biscuit, guys. Seven. Eight, seven, two is good. I like that. Because we have double black here and double black for this, but no double green except for this, so. This is my life now. This deck doesn't seem great, but it has great cards. Oof. Well, it's not... It's not great. Let's put it that way. Okay. 
Our opponent mulled the sixth. Our opponent's name is Moistly Done. That's that's not okay, man. Let's actually lead with this guy. You crazy. Super Fritz, when do you have to go to when do you have to go to work today? Do you not have to work today? Did you quit? Are you no longer art artisan sandwiches? Move this mic closer. Just making sure to sit up straight, guys. Posture is important. I'm gonna I'm gonna run these greens out so we can actually uh, adamant these two on turn five. Hopefully we don't die by then. I threw the toaster out the window and says, screw y'all. God, that's aggressive. It sounds like you really have some anger management issues that you probably want to get taken care of. Okay. I don't know if I want to play this guy here. I probably do. I mean, he's still just a 3-2, right? I'd rather just have a 3-2 on the board than... Nah, I'm good with my anger issues. Oh, jeez. Okay, well, they're just going to kill that guy. If I don't choose to click on cast it with adamant support and I still pay three green, do I still get the token, the counter? I had to open today. How many pepper jack with meatball sandwiches did you make? Really? This is what you're going to do? Dunzo in the bunzo. At least three, but we're really slow. Sundays are for chicken, as you know, and the meatballs just take a back seat. <laughs> At least three meatball and pepper jack sandwiches? Unbelievable. That's a that's a city I don't need to be in, my friend. Okay, they have to have two tricks here, right? But I'm tempted to like not even What if they kill it in response? It's a real tricky situation, man. Almost every deck in this format I've seen uh, has a has a card that I want to have returned to nature for. Oh god, he's just gonna like double pump this or this youthful knight's gonna be the strongest card. Oh, it's just gonna take. Okay. Well, well, well. Jury duty, try to answer the lawyer's questions in a way that would disqualify me from serving, but alas, I failed. So now instead of serving sandwiches, I'll be serving justice. 
<laughs> That's fantastic. If you were uh, picked to to serve jury duty, do you think you'd be fair and impartial? No, I'm a raging racist. I think it's a bad idea to probably to probably pick me. Wait. Uh, okay. Oh, they're just casting it. I was like, are they? That's pretty comical that my two creatures are giants. I was like, are they going to destroy all the creatures that are not giants? Justice goes real good on the Italian BMT. I think we're in good shape here. The smoke cheddar at Subway is a game changer. They stop letting us order that. <laughs> so, like anything that's like super good and they're like, oh, this is amazing. This changes everything. And you're like, mm, yeah, I don't order that anymore. Okay. Huh. I don't know what's happening right now. Okay. So I feel like we're the the game's just over right now. Uh, you on to you one two three four dunzo, and then we can equip forces them to block because they'll be at, and so we get a food, and this bro's got indestructible, so we get to eat both their gentlemen. And because this guy got pumped up with the Silver Flame Ritual, they can actually block. Otherwise, they would not be able to. Okay, three. Not bad. Not bad. Oh, this guy? Damn, boy! He's thick! Boy! That's a thick-ass boy! Damn! Boy! Interesting. All right, let's get in there. Are they like, maybe he won't attack? Oh, he's attacking. Oh, well then. Um, yeah, we can actually play Savvy Hunter. No reason not to, really. All the great promotional stuff that anybody actually likes stays for a month and goes away. It's super weird. While the cold cut combo, which is the most inedible thing I've ever seen, stays in the menu for the rest of eternity. What's on the cold cut combo? When is Subway getting gluten free bread? I am going to begin the sideboarding process. I'm going to bring in this return to nowhere. Return to nature, not return to nowhere. I don't know how words work, so sometimes I have a hard time talking. It's awkward that they gave me an English degree. I think I got Wolf's Quarry.
The garlic bread is gas, gone, so yeah, story checks out. It's like turkey bologna, it's effing horrible. The garlic bread is coming back soon, though. Oh my god. This is like the subway emotional roller coaster. Garlic bread smoothies for everyone. Nope, don't like that. Can I get that? Can I? I want a green screen of Michael Scott saying, nope, nope, don't like that. No, don't like that. No. <laughs> Maybe that sound clip. Maybe the sound clip might be satisfactory. I will keep this hand. It's not exciting. I think again it's like two five drops, but we have a removal spell this time. And we have all the uh all the red mana we could ever want, so. If we can actually draw our sweet, sweet bone crusher boy, or our nully gully. Grum gully, the nully gully. Isn't that what's called? No, of course it's not called that. That's ridiculous. Also, we're not looking good for this uh we're not looking good for this adamant here. Okay, well, we're definitely getting rid of that because it's problematic. Okay, well. One more green, then one more black. One, two, three, four, five. It's seven mana, that's all we need. That's all we need. You're not a smoothie guy. I understand it's hard to understand our culture. Our ways may seem strange to you, but we just like to eat our meals one glass at a time and are not trying to hurt anyone. That's fair, man. I I apologize. I was being... Um, I was being prejudiced against your people. And that was my fault. <laughs> Alright, so we attack, they make it indestructible. I'll just take four here. Let's see if they give it lifelink. Oh, they're gonna give it lifelink. Such life, much link. Wow. Come on, forest off the top. Let me out muscle. Feeling good about life. Not as great now. That's unfortunate. Does get a counter, so we could out muscle this guy and then just attack for four. I don't know if that's good. This hand is so much better with another green source. Five five is able to deal with this guy. Out muscles out able to deal with this guy. I mean, we could play paladin and then still out muscle this guy if they tap out next turn. Is this any good without? I think we're just waiting a turn. I, I'd rather just play the cards we can play now. And then uh, try to add him into when we can. Wow, that was really loud. That was the toilet seat just randomly falling down. Probably because ghosts. But uh, 
It definitely creeped me out. Uh, no blocks. Dude, it's so loud and it's so out of nowhere. I'm just like, oh, oh. If it happens in the middle of the night, like, if I had a gun, I'd probably just get a gun and start firing randomly because it just it's just that terrifying. Okay, man, we get it. You got lifelink. Green source. Son of a biscuit. Actually, I can probably stick this on here. Draw a green source. Play Savvy Hunter. Toilet seat can fall down if it's already down. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. Come on. I draw a Bone Crusher Giant, so I literally can't kill the one creature I was trying to kill. Whereas if... As if I didn't put this on there, I actually could have. That's comical to me. That's funny. This is nice. We attack, we get a, a food, we can sack the food immediately to, to make blocking impossible. Oh, they got a second white. They're going to destroy all creatures. It's all over, guys. We had a good run. I guess that's a three Thank for four, but... Pi, thanks so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Here we go. Oh, Jesus. Oh, jeez. That's really good. Gonna take seven, go to five. Because I don't feel like dying here. Wish I had one more mana that we can kill this in response. That would be real good. Real good. Okay, so. One, two, one, two, three, one, two. No, this guy is problematic. One, two, three to deal with this guy. One, two. God, this third green to not get an instructable is really throwing us here. I guess we can take one more hit. I mean, this is three, and then we have four mana left over. We could just get rid of both creatures, to be to be quite honest. But it would require sacrificing one of ours, right? Like, so it's, we're two for wanting ourselves for something. I think I'm going to risk it. We're going to go to one here. I think that's fine. We keep up shock. And we just hope they don't have plus two, plus two. Plus one, plus one. Right, but that's still the same thing. We're still killing one creature that way, Phil. Like, we're just blocking one, shrinking it, but then this force still gets through. So, like... X... Oh my god, he says it costs fire and neutral mana? That's pretty funny. How much neutral mana does it cost? 
That's actually pretty comical. Okay, four mana. Well, that's unfortunate. <clears throat> Come on, I need a forest here real bad. That's not... Ah, that's a blocker, though. That being said, your main board seems amazing. Wow. Uh, let's go to main. Play this guy. Now we have two creatures and a shock. All right. And... Yeah, we're just double blocking here. Do 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 do. Okay, I actually don't feel like we're in terrible shape here, despite being at one life. Unless they play the giant. Which they're going to do. Yep, have no idea how I'm going to deal with that. Green, give me a forest. That's not a forest. All right. Guess we're just hoping. I mean, it's a nine, actually 9-9 nine -nine with its H lab side. It's not terrible. Yep, there's your seventh land. And I'm tempted to shock here. No, because if we draw a green, we can actually shock this guy. Yep, that's what we wanted to do. All right, that's perfect. I, I overpaid. Don't care. I feel like we're in good shape here. Uh, oh god. Okay. That's fine. One, two, three. Oh wow, look, we did it. We're living the dream, guys. So dead up five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We have lethal. Hmm. 
Is that a second one? Wow. That's... That's a silly top deck. Yeah, can't actually attack here because they just give lifelink and or indestructible, probably indestructible. Wow, that was a really good top deck. It's actually really hard to deal with at this juncture. Indestructible. Sure. And lifelink. Sure. All right. If we had any creature here, it'd probably be a decent race because we can deal eight, put them to six. They go to five. They gain four, they go to nine, but then we still have eight on board and we could just chump block. But unfortunately, land is not really. Wow, this game is grindy. Oh, that's pretty good. And go back up to two now. Yep, got a block with old Grummy. Wow, any other creature and I feel like we would have been in great shape. Double Resolute Rider is just absolutely terrible. Can't even actually murderous rider doesn't even save us here because we died of the murderous rider. Mm, that doesn't do anything either, unfortunately. Um, I guess we still have a block. Doesn't seem great. Trapped in a tower on our guy, we return to nature it. <coughs> no? Okay. Well, I have to block. If only this was a 5-5 five, five instead. Well, I feel like we played this game well, too, but... Okay. We don't have four green, though. So, unfortunately... 
we have to hope they don't have trapped in the tower. And we can just keep chump blocking this guy. If they were considering trapped in the tower last turn and then decided against it because I have to chump block, then that's pretty rough because we have Return of Nature in hand. Okay, it's not trapped. Okay, that's fine. Those guys are actually not even that great because these just break even. This is an interesting board state. I lost a match earlier today to an opponent who tabled two Revenge of the Ruins against my Green Wicca Wine deck. Oh, God. Yeah, I imagine your 2 2s lost value, too, at that point. Huh. All right. Well, Revenge of the Ravens doing some serious work here. Drawbridge, not terrible. Not great, but not terrible. Cannot attack here. <clears throat> it's a stressful match. A lot of stress happening. It's only game one. Oh god. Or round one? Game one of round game two? Game one? Oh god, I don't know what's going on. I think I blacked out. getting bold I mean this is, has to be the way we block right okay are they, are they just getting life they might just be getting life interesting Nope, not gaining life. Okay. Sure. Well, we had a good run. Revenge of the Ridge pushed my grandma down the stairs. Oh, geez. Not grandma! Yep, that's pretty bad. Well, we can take a hit. I feel weird about just conceding here because, like, they have six minutes, we have 12 minutes, and, like, we have so much more, <laughs> like, we have turns. Like, try cracking a food token for <laughs> You guys are, you guys are too much. I can't handle you wacky wax jokesters. And we go to seven here, so I can actually just block and take three. And then we live to fight another day. Gain lifelink. Yep. So now they're back up to... Dude, Resolute Rider is just such a pain in the b-hole. Oh, wow. That's really good. I would have not given lifelink and then just played my second Resolute Rider this turn. But maybe that's just me. I feel like gaining an extra 4 life when you're at 24 is pretty greedy when you can just add another Resolute Rider to the board, but you gotta do what you gotta do, I guess. Did 
They also have to win in five minutes. <sighs> Not land. Oh, a land. All right, that's actually pretty good. That's pretty good. Are they just casting this? Wow, their top decks are so good, dude. Okay. <laughs> you got it. They don't really even need... I thought there was three, actually. I guess... I don't know. Whatever. It doesn't matter. We go up to four. God, we need one more blocker here. Oh my god, why are they doing this? Sure. You got it. Yeah, so yikes from me, dog. I actually kind of like Wolf's Quarry against them. I don't know. Maybe that's crazy. Hey, this is crazy. I like Wolf's Quarry against you, maybe. Especially with this Grum Gully. I think we're turning the nature out. We only saw one thing. Oh, <laughs> God. Mulligan, I guess. Eh, this is fine. Hand would have been good if we had lands. That's all. That's all hands. Oh yeah, Jano. Jano says that he's like, "On long last, we meet again for the first time, for the first of red times." Like his intros are great. That dude's hilarious. Um, yeah, okay. No blocks. No attacks. No anythings. No things. Ooh, one one black means you get to cast that dude, but without the ability. Get in there. Come on, block, I dare you. It's a great block for you. What? Wait, what? What? That, I don't understand that one. Oh, they did not attack. Fascinating. Oh, got be Resolute Rider. Yes. Yeah, I kind of like exiling this guy. Because then it can't come back ever again. I mean, I could have actually just killed this guy and attacked for four, but I don't know how, like... I don't know how good that's going to be. I mean, it's actually maybe it's pretty good.
This guy's a problem. Like, I just can't get through. Actually, if we draw out muscle, it'd be sick, though. Out muscle this guy, attack for five. They also have three minutes on the clock. That's pretty good. Fly me to the moon. I might just care about this guy more. I might actually just want to kill this guy. And then next turn... Yeah, we're just going to kill... It's so weird. Yeah, I don't care which one you block. Yep, they block neither. Because next turn if we hit land, we can play Grumgully and Murderous Rider with the with the counter as a three four, which is pretty sweet. Are we wiping the board? I feel like we're wiping the board. Oh, we're just festive festive funeraling. That is not a creature. I feel like if we can avoid Realm Realm Giant, Realm Raker. These attacks are super aggressive. Badger, what's going on, my dude? Good seeing you, my friend. Unless they're going to draw that every single fucking game. Okay. Sounds good. <sighs> Sounds good. Oh, that doesn't have haste, comically enough. I was like, oh, we can play this in attack. Nope. Guess not. And then I was hoping we can get this guy back, but now we're never going to get past... Yep, of course they have the seventh land on turn eight, because they missed only one land drop. So, just perfect. Would have kept Murderous Rider if they if I, if I just had the foresight to know they would draw this every single game, but... I guess not. Oh, Vigilance too, huh? So I can't even, like, try to chump block it and... Yep, that's a cool ability. Yep, that's... That's fun. How did you lose? Well, my opponent had a bomb and mythic rare, so I, I couldn't play the Magic the Gathering against him. You understand. They also went to uh, the lowest possible time. They used every second. I mean, do I just go to three here? Probably. really obnoxious and we have a big downfall in the graveyard so like we've used all of our yeah of course draw a double resolute rider realm cloak giant this game seems good pretty standard pretty standard um <laughs> just like why do I why bother why why bother Oh, you got you got some got some life gain tricks. Give my dudes haste then. What are you gonna do about that? Nothing. Sure. Well, they didn't play anything else. If 
That's actually not terrible, surprisingly enough. Watch, they're going to draw Trapped in the Tower on this guy. Oh, no. Well, we have to block both here, so... Guys. All right, so we're definitely blocking here and blocking here. The big guy does not have trample. So we're actually going to get Deathless Knight back, and we might be able to keep looping Deathless Knights. because of the food tokens and they have to win in like 50 seconds I mean they're probably going to be able to I don't have I don't have high hopes for this match because it's like it's always been it's been a it's been a struggle every single time but um we want to cast this and equip it so I want to actually crack the food now <sighs> that's interesting Wow, did we just have a game? Sure. Less of a game, but still okay, I guess. I have no idea. I mean, we're definitely double blocking this guy if the, if the opportunity arises. Which it did. Okay, lifelink. And indestructible? Sure. Okay, so they're tapped out. Block here as usual. I think we just won this game because of their time. That's insane. I mean, this was an extremely frustrating match gameplay-wise, but... So now they have six seconds to win this game. And we're at 13. Yeah, there's no way they can deal 13 damage in three seconds. Wow. Wow. Oh my god. What even, dude? I'm tempted to keep this. We can play both of these with any green, and any green turns on our entire hand. Man, Spider 1 5 blocking mono resolute riders is insane. I will keep. And we're on the draw, so we get that extra card. One step closer to a green source. God dang, we're good at this game. These are both green, so we can go green into mountain to keep this up, into swamp to cast either one of these. Probably this. Forever Young, just a cantrip. I've seen that way too many times. I mean, it could also be Bone Crusher, Grum Gully into Bone Crusher. I 
want to play hunter first because we have no second play we have no play for for the next turn so if we're going to play a three three i'd rather have the one that starts making food for us Also, Grum Gully into Wolf's Quarry seems insane. But I think this game is probably over. We have two high powered uncommons. Our hand is stacked. And, uh. Yeah. Yep, that was a solid game. It was not that solid. It was like the opposite of a solid game. I'm gonna keep this hand. This red is a little awkward here. This hand is no nowhere as good as the last hand, but still pretty good. <laughs> I feel a little gassy. All right, I need one more swamp, and I think we can call it a day. I really have no interest in downfalling that guy. Whew. Um, meh. I'd love to cast this guy or this guy. We can cast neither of these at the mountain in hand. We can cast Garen Brig Carver, though, which I think is fine. Stop playing things. Oh man, I'm so fed up with Youthful Knight. You have no idea. Okay, I accept. Oh, just stop. I mean, I'm just gonna let this dude through. He can come through. I'll take eight, and then I'll just epic downfall it. <sighs> Grum Gully. That seems okay. What? These are O ones. I mean, this seems fine. Like, if you want to trade removal spell for, I'll trade insatiable. This guy's this guy's really problematic just for, like, this guy. Oh, it's a little bird. What up, little bird? Thank God I exiled the Clack Clan Cridge Bridge Ironworks. Is that what his name is? So we're going to take three, but then we can outmuscle this. They're probably going to play Lost Legion here, which is fine. God, 
you have more things? Can you leave my Grumgully alone? Yeah, that's fine. Okay, none of these things are things I really care about here. Cast from you to you. One, two, three, four. This feels good because Wolf's Quarry is just insane. Three two twos that make. The, oh, wow. That's how you're going to be? Okay. Okay. Well, this is actually fine. I mean, like, now it's just an enchantment, right? Like, it's just still fine. Land. Really? Really? You can't just give me a land? Is it too much? I don't even want a foreboding fruit here, especially not for no value. We have two blockers, so I guess like as long as they don't top deck something, we're okay. Like you can always block here. I don't know what they could top deck. A pump spell probably. Plus three, plus three. Now I guess we're fine. Oh, they did nothing. I'm a fan. All right, let's start getting in there. Yeah, the only pumps are, are two power, right? I, yeah, that's what I was thinking. That's why I, I resigned myself to be like, yeah, they can't do anything here. So one, two, we can go Deathless Knight. One, two, three, four. Up, oh, uh, four. And then we get to keep up Murderous Rider. It's a Murderous Rider. Seems fine. Both of the cards in our hand <laughs> deal less damage. Actually, Forbidding Fruit gains us a life if we pay three black. I think I think this game's over. Targeting themselves. Okay. It's murder. That was pretty good. All right. We are 2-0 right now. Let's see if our three-color deck can close it out. Oh, man. We're getting close, man. We're getting close. That round one was pretty frustrating, though. Like, every game having to deal with Realm Cloak Giant. Not the best. I'll keep this hand. Okay. Okay. Hmm. 
What a bog naughty. I like I don't care about any of these creatures. That's a pretty weak charm sleep, I'll be honest. I mean, this is a pretty weak out muscle, but this guy's still good. <laughs> if we can get this charm sleep off of them somehow. Johnny, big, large, and talls. Welcome back, my dude. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Back, back, back. All right, we're just going to pass here. I don't know what they have here. nothing this holding counter spells there you go counter this <laughs> okay I'm glad to be back friends are we back friends sure Well, this is going to get countered, I'm sure, because they've been just... Nope. Okay. Fascinating. Well, I'm sure they're just going to kill it then, right? They have five cards in hand. They're going to bounce it. Yep, that's what I figured. Okay. <sighs> So we're at 10. I guess that's fine. I mean, I'm really just tempted a murderous rider here. Because, like, we're going to take one more and then we're going to go to seven and, like, I want I want to just cast the murderous rider and then equip it or play Bognati or I want to start making some food. Okay, we really need one more land. Like we have a bunch of things to do with this much mana, but not. I'm playing this because I want to be able to equip it next turn and just start life linking. Forever. Oh, 
hope they try to kill this, and then I can insatiable appetite it next turn. That seems great. Wow. Or I can just attack for two. Which I think is fine. Now we just gained five. Oh, that's gas. Oh, I feel like we're doing well here. I don't know. Sure. Wow, they just milled swamp forest, swamp crashing drawbirds. That seems great for us. Yep, definitely bring in return. One, two, three, four. I just don't care about any of these creatures, so I'm just going to pass. <laughs> Ginger Brute. This is all very fascinating. I don't have anything to do. I guess we'll just attack here. And I get a food here? Oh man, this is just too much. So, one, two, three, four, five. Buddy, I got some treats to share. Let's talk about how good <laughs> making random food items is when you got Bog Naughty in play. Yep. Oh, wow. That's okay. Return to nature. Fell the Pheasant seems good, but like they didn't have that many great flyers. It was just like a bunch of 1 1 Dirtles. Plus, we already have Spore Cap Spider. Take out Wolf's Quarry, I guess. I will keep this hand. Hmm. 
Hmm. Okay, well, the problem with going second and not playing anything until turn three is that you're just going to discard something with Forbidding Fruit. Oh, wow. That was like the best draw we could have asked for, I think. I think we're just throwing fruit here, right? They have like nothing out there. Plus, we want to hit a land for um, Paladin next turn. We did. We want to hit a second black, though, as well. So, Paladin as a 6 6 seems pretty nuts next turn. They're playing three colors now? What's even happening? Uh, no blocks. I'll take three. We're at 13 already? Good lord. This set feels like an unset? That's interesting. I think this set is great. <laughs> oh, good times. Oh, they did not come at me. They don't have an answer for the 6-6 six, six is what I'm, what I'm feeling here. You can feel it all over. I think it's silly and complete nonsense. How is that like in a bad way? Because like I feel like Lorwyn is a much more silly set. I got some treats to share though if you if you're really interested. Let's play Ravens here. Oh no, they're gonna counter this? Oh, Jesus. Um. It's actually, this is actually a situation where if we, actually we can out-muscle, we can out-muscle the Lockmere Serpent. Can't be blocked. Oh, God. Are we dead? No, because we're gaining the life. Okay, good. Jeez. Yep. Always yield to these guys. We're definitely just uh, blocking here because I don't want them to kill us with food. I only have three cards in the graveyard after we out muscle, so that's actually fine. Hmm. 
And we definitely don't have... Yeah, we can just crack this food. So none, none of our guys can block our guy, which is kind of like the same as unblockable. <laughs> and even if they crack the golden egg for food... Um... Like, they still go to five, and they're still dead to this guy. So I'm going to keep our egg up just in case. Because they can go, like, deal us three, deal us three, if they can, like, play another egg or something. So I'm actually going to crack the food now. Make sure we break even. All right. So they have to draw an answer to this guy, or a way to... <sighs> Alright, I mean, it's not bad because we have Revenge of Ravens, right? So, like, that's actually not the worst. That is comically not bad. Because none of them can block, and none of them can really even attack. So, top deck something? That's insane how good how good Revenge of the Ravens is against fairies. I think we're going to 3-0, man. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on patreon.com slash franklapore. The link is in the description below, and you can uh, support the channel for like $1 to $2 a month, which is basically nothing. It's just a super great way to support the channel. So hopefully you guys... Uh... Also, if they attack with two creatures, they just die. Okay, so they're dead. Oh, now they, they have a blocker. Uh, I'm going to destroy this artifact. <laughs> oh, man. Good times. Thank you for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. I will see you guys next time. You guys are wonderful. And uh, don't forget to click all the links below. CoolStuffInc.com. ManusTraders.com. They are great services, and I will see you. I will see you next time.